Hey everyone! Welcome back. I am back today with more Demon Slayer, which I am so excited about. If you're joining me early today, it means you are one of my awesome patrons. Thank you, thank you, thank you for everything. And as always, I'm sending you those big old hugs right through the screen. And if not, still thank you for joining me today. I'm glad you're here. I do hope you'll consider supporting me that way. The link to my Patreon is going to be in the description down below. Uh, so we had a pretty big cliffhanger last episode of Demon Slayer. <laughs> and you guys know how I do with the cliffhangers, particularly when they're followed by, followed by the infamous red flowers. Um, <laughs> so um, we had a really good episode last time. Um, we had Inosuke trying to hold his own against this dad spider person um, and kind of going through his own little emotional arc. And we, we saw a little tease, like a tragic backstory for him. Um, and then he's like just barely like not even holding it together. And all of a sudden Giyu shows up and just makes like easy work. <laughs> so I can't wait to see more of him. You guys know I've been dying to see more of him for like... Since the show started, I'm like, what's his deal? What's it, what's going on there? I want to know more. Um, so um, we also, we didn't have too much follow-up on Zenitsu. Um, we know that the butterfly girl, I don't know her name yet, I'm sorry. I'm probably not going to know her name for a while. Um, we know she showed up, so like, thank God, I feel like he's like... I can kind of think in my head that, like, okay, well, he's getting, like, medical treatment or something, you know? Like, he's not just, like, waiting out there, like, dying. Um, and uh, we had the Tanjiro moment where he is battling this one of the, the family demons. Like, I guess, like, the brother, I think. Um, and he's battling that demon and goes in it looks like you know he's the threat is like he can picture it it's like the perfect attack moment and uh he goes in he goes to slash and his sword breaks um actually i think he was slashing one of the webs or was he slashing like the thread that he makes like that he sees either way his sword snapped right in two um and then and then they ended it and you guys know, you know how I do with cliffhangers, and I don't do very well. Spoiler alert <laughs> for anyone who is new to my videos. Um, they drive me wild. So uh, there's only one way to find out what's going to happen next, and that's to dive right into the next episode. Um, I have seen some of you guys comment. Uh, thankfully, nothing like spoilery. Thank you guys so much for like being considerate about that. But I've seen people hint at like wait till episode 19 and I'm like what do you mean um so I think I'm in for uh quite the episode so without further ado let's jump right in let's see how what bad shape I'm in by the end of this episode <laughs> next episode of Demon Slayer let's do this you guys I don't even know where to begin. To everyone who warned me that this episode would be overwhelming for me, you were a thousand percent right. I don't even know where to begin. Um, a really cool twist that it was the brother of this family that was one of the 12 ki Kizuki. Um, and I kind of started to wonder after the dad got killed, I'm like, wait, if he wasn't, and I know they had kind of built up this, like, really ominous presence with the brother ever since we first encountered him. Um, so I thought that was a really good twist. Um, Inosuke and his little uh, enamorment with uh, Gyu was fun and wanting to defeat him. <clears throat> Gyu, was, Gyu was on, like, a whole other level, though. He was right. Um... So Zenitsu is being medically treated, thank God. Um, you guys, we 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 need to talk about like the last 10 minutes of this episode. So we got so much dropped on us. The dad, who we've never seen before. I don't think we've ever seen him before. I don't remember seeing him. If he was in there, like he was <laughs> he was like in a photo frame in the background, like I did not notice. Um now 
A few episodes back, Kibutsuji mentioned the earrings, I think they're called Hanapura, I don't think I'm saying that right, but you know, you guys know the earrings. I wonder if he was referring to the dad, um, because the dad mentioned in the flashback the earrings. Um, also, um, Nezuko spoke, I don't think she spoke spoke, it was like in her head, but like, I don't know if I've ever heard her talk. Um, and she got to exercise her blood demon art to help Tanjiro. So it was interesting to me that the mother appeared to her and the father appeared to Tanjiro. Um, wow. So there's like a, there's a whole other thing there. The dad being frail, the dad knowing all this about the breathing and the, and all the different stuff. The fact that Tanjiro would just remember that now, like it's all... There's a lot more to it. Like, I have a lot more questions now. We got, like, 1.5 answers and, like, a million more questions. Um, that was beautiful. The song, everything. It, it was breathtaking. This show is breathtaking. Storytelling, animation, execution, everything. Voice acting. It is breathtaking. And <laughs> my breath is gone. <laughs> I feel like I'm going to have a lot more to say after I've digested it a little bit more. And I know there were, like, things happening super quick. Like, I can't remember now the name of Nesco's blood art. I Don't worry, because I will once I, I'm editing the episode. Like, I'll see it and everything. Um, but everything just happens so fast. Like, there's no wasted moments on the show. And I know that, like, the more I think about it and the more I, like, you know, while I'm editing, going to be going back and watching the scenes and everything... Like, I'm sure there's even, like, a ton of hidden information that isn't even, like, surfacing on my brain right now because I'm just so overwhelmed and it all happened so quickly. Great app. You guys, you were so right. That was epic. Thank you so much for joining me. Please join me next time. We'll watch it together. I can't wait to see you then. Bye for now, guys.